And good afternoon, YouTube fans. This is Admiral Preparedness here. Got another package in the mail today from our friends across the Pacific Ocean. Let's see what's inside so I can do a review on it. Alrighty, what we have here is the... Well, let's see... There's consumer packaging all the way from China. I'm sure it came by air and packaging. It's called the Cooking Set Outdoors, same company that I just reviewed a previous product set on. It has your retail box, all the information about what's inside of the container. And it uh, looks like it's seen its day as far as uh, being around the, um, <clears throat> the stores or wherever. Let's open it up. Okay, folks, it has another one of those fantastic fishnet style holders, which I would really like these because, again, you could use these for anything. Picking berries, things that you need to carry around with you other than being used to hold this guy together. Okay, what we have here is your Asian style rice spoon. You have the bottom bucket or pan. This has a different style handle. Interesting. It's a molded plastic style handle. It's got a kind of a, it doesn't have like a non-grip type material, but more of a knurled type. Trouble is the knurls on the, the knurl should be on this side and not on this side because you hold it like this. So that's a, if you look here, you can see it. There you go. There's a good picture of these guys here need to be on this side because, well, because <clears throat> when you hold it, these don't do you any good. I mean, unless you're holding, I don't even, I don't get that part at all. But okay. All right. So you have this uh, shipping plastic to keep it from being damaged. There you go, off the ground up, space program style. You get a sponge or a material type sponge. This is kind of neat. This is a, a scoop that you can scoop out your food with. You have to release it by squeezing it and put it back. That's interesting. Definitely has an Asian flair to it. It comes apart so it's easier to clean. You know, just squeeze it together. We'll leave that to Smith with that. You get two bowls with a little grasp that you can grasp it. Hold on to it so you don't slide out of your hands because this is a little bit slippery. Your deep dish bucket or pail or what are you going to call these things this is a lid the lid goes on like that again it has the easy grab so you don't burn your fingers it has the form injection molded style formed handles these are okay it's got the weld these are actually um, rivets they're water resist I'm sure the water you know they been tested so they don't allow any liquids to come out. Aluminum. Uh, the cleaning crew come by and apparently uh, didn't get the leash taken off, so somebody's gonna get chewed out later. Okay, the only thing I understand with C would be is uh, there's no nothing wrong with anything I see here. Everything looks like it would be easy to clean uh, with the uh, handle down. got it the wrong way but that's okay it's easy plastic's a little flimsy but I'll take that as a okay thing <clears throat> your bowls easy to clean slippery so food will come right off I'm sure the uh, oil and materials will just come right off definitely has that Asian flair to it with the little rice spoon that's what they normally call it. I see these overseas a lot in the Asian countries you don't see them in Europe 
America you do because of all the different uh, things that we do here. Okay, now remember, the pot lid goes on that one, but it won't go on that one. So you don't have a pot lid for the frying pan. You have a pot lid for the boiling or whatever you want to use that guy for. Uh, this is pretty good so you can fry an egg or fry a couple of eggs, do your bacon. Uh, it is your hard style aluminum uh, aircraft style. It's not flimsy. It'll definitely go in your backpack, emergency bug out bag, or um, anywhere you want to use it. I'd use it at home if I had a small kitchen. Uh, a lot of these college kids today are living in their rooms. Uh, don't put this in a microwave, obviously, because it's metal. A convection oven's fine. Hell, you could actually even uh, uh, bake in this. Bake, fry, saute. Perfect. It's small. My hand fits. This is my hand, a regular size human hand. Pretty good there. It's all nice and compact. Everything fits right inside. That's why I like it because I want to be able to get in and get out and be able to use it. Packs in with itself. Not sure how that works. I'll figure that part out again. Again, you have your, this is, you could use this meshing. You could wash your clothes with it, you know, go on a riverside or a pond or pool, whatever. It's good to put fish in there, minnows, nice for minnows. Uh, it's reversible if you want a, a nice, it has a, a, a pretty well put together. Got your gather. Everything I would need that uh, I enjoy. The best thing about it is, is you can take this out and clean it. You can do it out in the field or you can do it at home, depending on your situation out there. Uh, one good thing about these type of camp sets, emergency stoves, these are compact, they're lightweight. This probably, where's my scale? I'm gonna weigh it. It's one thing I didn't do with the other one. Weigh it out. <clears throat> See how much you're gonna have to carry with you while you're out there in the field. Weight's a whole big issue out there while you're uh, looking for things. All right, without the mesh, it's 14 ounces. With the mesh, it's, one, it's 15 ounces even. So on just right under a pound, you've got yourself a good way to heat your food, cook your food, boil water, everything you need to get out there in the, in the, in the world, real-time camping, hike, hiking, day trips, picnics, wherever you go. You don't have to carry, you don't have to bring the spoon with you. You don't have to bring these guys with you either, but they do well. They do nest well inside of the the bowl. And as you can see, it all goes together really nicely. Fit it right back inside the, the meshing pouch. And, uh, of course, having the, uh, if you watch my other videos, you can use the small camp-style, backpacker-style stoves. Uh, the thing about it is, what you have to remember, is when you have food in it, it's going to weigh. So that hopefully helps stabilize it while it's being cooked. So... And better than saying that, I'll give this an A+. Plus. Two thumbs up. Having preparedness here. Remember one thing. Take care of your country. It's the only one you've got. Take care, folks.